guys, uh, welcome to my channel. If you haven't been here, I'm sitting in our new house on the stairs. I'm gonna go into my studio and I'll show you a little bit about my new space and uh, talk a little bit about what I'm doing in art today. Hey guys, so it's been a while since I've done the, uh, the face vlogging thing on. I haven't found my makeup since we moved, so I don't really wear it day to day, but whenever I do wear it, whenever I vlog I wear it, and so people are like, oh, you look good, and I'm like, I did a video, <laughs> so. I wanted to talk to you guys about some of the stuff I've been working on with art. I show, I'm gonna show you guys the boxes that I did and like how I did the Etsy thing. I wanted to talk a little bit about like the whole streamlining process. So I've been like trying to streamline my Etsy shop and my artwork and that type of thing. So I'm making it easier, like making it take less time to do the things. So instead of doing one product a day, which was my goal for a while, I'm trying to do like 10 products all at once. So I'm just trying to like block my time out better to where I can do uh, several of the same type of task all at once, get in that habit. And um, you can see the products I did. I did 10 of them today, it was super exciting. Um, I opened my shop yesterday and I have four products in there now. Cause like I had like 30 some things like, uh, expire while we were moving, which I didn't expect. So I have a lot of redoing to do, but that's good because I really wanted to do like the product line and all of that type of stuff. So, um, yeah, I guess that's a little bit like, this is my studio. It's, it's a mess right now. Let me, I'm gonna turn around the camera so you guys can actually see what's up. Hey guys. So I showed you these boxes a couple days ago and, uh, I showed you what they looked like all together. What I'm doing right now is I took the lid of a shoe box and then a background thing that's kind of scratchy and I'm making photos for Etsy. So I'm taking different photos and then I'm editing them on, I'm, so I'm doing this all on my phone because I don't have Photoshop anymore. And I'm editing them on Facebook and like sharing them to Facebook. I have a secret album that is all just like promo photos. And then I'm screenshotting them on my Mac and then uploading them into different products. And then so I'm creating the products and I'm going to post them all at the same time. Well, I have two up and then I'm going to post a bunch of them on the same day. Kind of doing like the whole product line thing. And then you can see where I'm taking the photos. I have it set up so I can just use my phone. Um, it's going pretty well. I really like this technique. But I just wanted to say hey and welcome to my studio. And this is what I'm doing today. Alright, so this is the vintage filter on the Galaxy phones. I'm just showing you another viewpoint of how I'm doing. Um, there you go. So I'm just showing you another like bit about what I do. I take all the photos and then I'll probably share this one on Instagram and I shared another one a couple days ago. I'm working on the whole product line thing from uh, Renee Christine's Smart Mom Business. But I wanted to show you guys another section of what I'm doing. This is the filter that I tend to use, or that I'm using right now, I guess, for this photo. I'm gonna share this on Etsy and then along with that, I am doing, um, following Renee Christine's uh, product line formula where there's the 10 different products, there's two, there's certain colors, there's certain price ranges, all those things. So this is one of them, but also with the scalable business practices, I'm trying to do the, here's one of the examples with uh, jewelry in addition to that. So I'll have those up online as well for the shop. So you guys can check those out in a couple days. All right, so I just shared this as an Instagram photo, but these are the jewelry boxes that I'm taking tomorrow for the fest, um, for the World Relief Fundraiser for Housing for Refugees. And so I'm not sure what percentage I'll be donating or if I'll just donate a flat sum to those guys, like an entry fee kind of for a regular show. And let me know if you want one and I can still get it to you. So thanks guys. Talk to you later. Bye. So it's, it's pretty messy, but, um, it's also not that bad. Like I still have piles of stuff that I'm like, I don't know what to do with you. I have lots of trash bags. The only the one is actually for trash. Eh, I need to figure that out. I really want to do a DIY wire hanging system on this wall. I have one in mind that um, won't be tracks, but it'll be everything. It'll be very similar to tracks. Um, there's also an easier way that I might do it that'll look good. And it'll be easier to update as I decide what I want to do. So that's, I actually sleep in here a lot. I am a floor sleeper. So that's my, <laughs> I'm not a minimalist as you can tell by the rest of the space, but like certain habits, I do have like minimalistic characteristics. Like I've been a floor sleeper for several years. Um, if I do fall asleep in our bed, I will like wake up with a headache and a kinked neck and move to the floor almost every night. Even when we travel or like stay at someone else's house, like I'll start in the bed and I'll, I will end up on the floor usually by like 2 a.m. by midnight if I go to sleep. I don't know. So anyways, there's that. Um, I'll show you some of the cool stuff I'm doing as well in future videos. Let me know what you want to see. If you want to see the comb decor stuff, if you want to see more art, just art, if you want to see speed paints. I have a tattoo video in the making. Um, uh, I'm gonna do a simple one. I have a couple ideas for future tattoo videos. Do let me know what you guys want from me because I, I 
am kind of getting my channel back and going. Like, I'm super excited. I did a lot, just kind of like a super long, uh, I kind of took a break over vlog, over Veda, which uh, maybe wasn't so wise, but um, still, that's okay. I'm, I'm okay with it. And the day's day stuff was, I just didn't have time to do every single day. So anyways, let me know what you guys want. I am totally up for, I want to keep it art and social change through art. I'm going to try to focus on those things. So if I do like home decor stuff, it will be home decor that is social change through art. So I'm going to go to another room. Um, I can do a house tour too, but you guys got to let me know. Like you got a thumbs up, you got to like, you got to share. Like if I don't get a response for it, I'm not going to do it just because I don't want to just make videos to make videos. I guess I'll do my intro now. So, hey guys, uh, welcome to my channel. If you haven't been here, I'm sitting in our new house on the stairs. I'm gonna go into my studio and I'll show you a little bit about my new space and uh, talk a little bit about what I'm doing in art today. And that's that, I guess. So, I know this is terrible lighting. I don't have a lighting set up, so thanks for hanging in there. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and if you liked this, be sure to subscribe. I make art and culture travel videos every single Tuesday, and I continue to plan I plan on... Con hey guys, if you like this video, be sure to subscribe. If you're interested in what I do as far as art and social change through cultural art, what all that means, do subscribe. I make videos every Tuesday, and I throw in a few others here and there as well. But I do one a week. I try to make it up on Tuesdays. So thanks guys, and I will see you around. Thanks for watching guys. If you like this, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I'll have art videos every Tuesday and then other random videos throughout the week. If I don't get my art video up on Tuesday, it'll go up on Thursday, but um, yeah, so videos every week and subscribe and I'll see you guys around. Check out my Etsy shop as well.